This horse is very sound, but every barn has their horses with some little aches and pains. They are athletes after sure. all. So what are some of the common injuries and um, situations that you use MagnaWave on? It's good for everything, Jenny. Uh, predominantly, we use it for, as you see with Fed, the soft tissue. I mean, they get most of their momentum from their from their rear end, so we focus a lot on that. And then just as you go over, as Rob was kind of talking about, he does Fed every day, so he knows kind of how he checked the day before and the week before. So he goes kind of on a day-by-day -day basis to see what, if anything, might be checking a little different than it was the day before. But uh, mainly soft tissue is what we, we prefer to I, it looks like, look at him, he's just sitting there eating some salad, some... Well, and it's, it's relaxing for him. It's just like you getting a massage, and he, he loves it. He's a, he's a big, big stud colt, and he's kind of tough to deal with, but Rob comes in, he loves it. It's kind of his after-training after training therapy session, exactly what it is. Talk about using MagnaWave, like on this horse. He's sound, you want to keep him sound, as a preventative um yeah, Measure. again, just again, you're talking rear end type stuff. It's just you keep them happy back there. They they tend to stay stay better up front, and uh, just trying to get him to feel as happy and healthy as he can be. Um, do you focus more on the full body or specific areas? Like you said, you start, you know, a lot of focus on the rear end, the engine there for a horse. Every horse is different, uh, but. Again, we like to, but Rob will start off by, as you see the big double loop there, he starts off with a, with a smaller loop or paddle just to kind of go over them to see where they might be checking, and then just kind of take it on a horse by horse basis. How do you find the racehorses react to Magna Way? Say it again, Jay? How, how do you find racehorses react to Magna Way? Well, again, just look at him. I mean, he's a, again a big, tough, tough good doing cold and he just sits there and he loves it they it's just like you going to get a massage it's relaxing for them they they'll be in here yawning sleeping letting all the, the bad bad toxins out taking in the good oxygen so they, you focus more on specific areas like you mentioned here that focusing on the rear end or uh, uh, the full body Again, it's a horse by horse thing. Uh, one like him, it's full body because he doesn't really have anything that we're working on. But if a horse has a specific, specific ailment that we're trying to trying to work on, then we we'll focus on that with him. What's the biggest improvement you've seen with Magna Wave? With him, uh, maybe not necessarily specifically major fed, but with horses, what's the biggest improvement you see when you start a horse on Magna Wave? Just getting them to feel better. It just, it, a massage and it gets into cellular therapy massage is what it is. It just it alleviates pain and aches is what it does. What about unpaid beauty, the ovaries? Real good on ovaries. There you go, real good on ovaries. For Phillies, we all know how problematic they can be. Um, Turn her right around. How long have you been using MagnaWave on Major Fed? Um, pretty much at, once they get up to racing, we we kind of start getting them on, uh, especially a horse like him who's been running in the, the big time races. We've had it on him every day, kind of pretty much after after he got to where he was ready to race. And what's the biggest improvement you've noticed with Magna Wave? Again, it just keeps him it keeps him good, especially with this year. We've had to kind of start and stop a lot of different times with the pandemic and all the different training training changes they've made to our. Uh, our hours and days and all that kind of stuff. So there was just some body soreness and that kind of stuff as far as just with the, the different breaks and uh, I think it's just helped keep him together, which he's been kind of in the derby hunt the entire time, which this year especially has been a testament to him and kind of everything that we do with him. When do you find it beneficial? You said this horse is using it pretty much every day, but when do you find it beneficial to address before a race and timing-wise, how many days out from a, a race? Uh, we usually do three. We'll do three, kind of as a pre-race, and then sometimes after the race or before or after a breeze also. Is there a certain time frame or a routine that works best for the horses, or does it depend just on, on whether the horse is in the derby or not? Yeah, just every horse is different. I mean, some don't need it as much. Uh, again, we're doing obviously everything we can to try to move him up as much as we can. But, uh, yeah, again, it's just horse by horse basis.
how long is the average session for a horse? I mean, Rob has it on set for about an hour a day. It's usually 30 minutes is, is probably enough. But, but double up when you're in oh, the derby. Yeah. Derby, derby baby gets double, double time. And then now that we have this horse here, Major Fed, and he's getting his Magna Wave treatment. See how long they just spend on this one area, and that's gonna, but he's gonna go over many areas on the body. And you were saying the other day, you even took it all the way down to, like towards his feet. It helps feet too, sore feet. I use the paddle for the feet, and put it right on the coronet band there, it helps sore feet. And. Grab a hit that green button, please. What are we doing with the green button here? That's the start of the game. See, it's got a oh, timer that only ten, goes 10 minutes. minutes. Oh, I see. Okay. And so now we've moved it. You see, right where that sets right there, I can do the, the withers and everything. It's just getting it all. I kind of go like this and hold this other end up, shoulders. So, Travis, here we are with Major Fed. How does yeah, it right. feel to have a horse in the Kentucky Derby? We have enjoyed every second of the ride. It's obviously Dad's first derby starter, and uh, it's just really excited for him to be able to enjoy this, and just the whole barn is, we're just having a blast with it. We think we're taking the right type of horse over there. He's done nothing wrong, and uh, as far as distance goes, we think he'll love the mile and a quarter. It's just, it's been a strange year, and we're just happy to be a part of it. In that regard, the extra four months you've gotten to, because like you said, he was ready to run if the right. Derby had been the first Saturday in May. You oh, got an yeah. extra four months out of it. Right, that's a credit to, to Dad and the horse and Magna Wave and everything we've been doing as far as keeping him keeping him together for a long, long Derby stretch. Okay, this is the paddle you were talking about. That's my favorite, favorite of all the connections. And how do you use this, this paddle on them? Okay, I'm gonna do his knees now, and I'm gonna move it. I'm gonna move it around. I'll do a couple minutes. I'll go to the side and the back. He's so happy eating this. Hey, here I gotta. Okay, yeah. Is that the you said it's your favorite? Is it, how about is it made your Fed's favorite? Uh, he likes this when I do this on his body too. Like if you really have a problem area, this right here. See, it even says zoom on it. I said it zooms in better. It penetrates more. If I turn, you know, like say if he had sore shoulders, I put it on there and turn the intensity up as much as he could stand it. It really helps a lot. And this is for the feet. This is all you can use on the feet. I'll put it right here on the four mat band. The horse is a bad feet. I mean, he doesn't have anything bad on his legs. I mean, but the whole thing is, you want to keep it that way. Exactly. Exactly. You know, it's like going to the gym and working out. And everything. Wait a minute. Somebody about the. Keeping them um Yeah, I'll just if I had a problem area that's really bad, like say the shoulders, that's what I would use would be the paddle and turn the intensity up as much as he could stand it and it really penetrates good. Yeah. So like I said, the whole thing is he doesn't have a problem but you want to keep him that way. Exactly. I mean, we could all use a good massage every day. But uh, horses that would, that would really help the most, take an old arthritic gilding. You know, like a seven, eight year old been running hard all his life, a little arthritic, it would really help a horse like that tremendously.
What do you think, Brian? We got the champion here. And we got the magna wave to make sure he stays good. <laughs>